six. I just stepped outside. The sun is shining. Didn't have a jacket on. It felt All right. quite nice. Can't yeah. wait to get out there. Yeah. Mm. Dry skies today. Dry skies tomorrow. Then finally we get some rain on uh, Thursday and might actually linger for a couple more days. But okay. most of the rain's Thursday and we could use it because we've had an extremely dry autumn. The last rain that was beneficial was back on October 7th. So like 42, 43 days or so and we had three quarters of an inch of rain. We've had other little batches of rain, but you know, they fall in the morning and they dry up in the afternoon. Not overly beneficial. The drought situation, we continue with a moderate to severe drought across most of Rhode Island. All of southern New England continues with very dry conditions. Uh, some wind gusts today and the very dry brush in place could allow any brush fires to spread very quickly. We keep saying it. Please, no outdoor burning. We are looking at a bit of a breeze here in Newport Harbor, but blue skies, maybe a few clouds there in the distance, some high clouds. And in East Greenwich, we are looking at blue skies. Bit of a breeze from the west northwest, 13 miles an hour, 46 degrees, making it feel a little bit cooler with a wind chill of 40. We're at 39 now in Hope Valley, 45 in Narragansett, mid to upper 40s over in southeastern Massachusetts. All of New England, super quiet this morning, pretty much the way it's been for the past month and a half. We do have some showers to our west. They're going to try and work in, but they're going to kind of. Uh, lose their support. Not much in the way of energy to keep those showers going into southern New England. So we're going to be dry right through uh, today and into tomorrow morning. But look what happens. Another batch of rain developing with on that frontal system to our west with an area of low pressure developing along the front. will kind of slow things down a little bit, allowing us to get a little bit more in the way of rain for Thursday. Starts in the morning around sunrise-ish and then continues into the evening hours. And certainly that could be a beneficial rain. Also looking at the possibility for some uh, strong wind gusts, maybe from the east and northeast on Thursday. Rainfall forecast, here's how much we're expecting just for Thursday's rain. Anywhere between a half inch, maybe up to a little bit more than an inch of rain. We definitely could use that. We could use double that amount for sure, but we'll take everything that we can get. 57 degrees for a high today. No rain for today. Be a little bit cooler than yesterday, but still a nice day. Out on the bay, winds from the northwest, 5 to 10, gusting to 25, especially in the morning. Uh, waves 1 to 2 feet. Visibility's fine. High tide about an hour from now in Newport. Now for tonight, we are looking at uh, clear skies. Dry, chilly, overnight lows getting down to around 38. And then for tomorrow, high temperatures should be right around 56 degrees with a blend of sunshine and clouds. Our winds becoming more northeast through the day tomorrow, 5 to 10 miles an hour out ahead of that developing uh, weather system to our west. Thursday, rain and wind, 52 degrees for a high. Uh, rain showers in the morning, becoming more of a steady rain for a while, rain into the evening, and then rain showers on Friday. Not raining all the time, but there will be showers around. A few showers perhaps even lingering on Saturday. Drying